Are you one of the people who sat through that exciting 24 hour livestream for the newest installment of the Pokemon series? Well if you are, I'm sorry for your loss of time. You'll never get those 24 hours back. I for one, figured heck, I'll just go about my day as normal and occasionally check Twitter to get my updates on any reveals. It was a fun experience, I would occasionally join the stream and watch people getting excited because some bush had rustled for the upteenth time or impudent breathed on the camera. Eventually, it was fully revealed that the whole livestream was one long way to reveal a new form of an old Pokemon, Ponita, or Ponita. A very welcome form change in my opinion, I'm a big fan of the design and the way they looked up at the sky and got excited at the end gave me high hopes for a Pegasus based Rapidash form. Something interesting to note about the designs was that one of the Ponita didn't have a tail. Uh, this is likely a difference with the genders, but it's an extremely unusual one given that ponies in real life still have a tail no matter the gender. But hey, it's Pokemon, who am I to question the world Game Freak created? The mane gives off a rainbow-like feel, indicating that this is likely going to be a fairy type, and the lack of any sort of flame-like movement from the mane tells me it's likely won't be part fire. I can see it being a pure fairy type and evolving into a fairy flying type Rapidash, which would be amazing to see to say the least. I really can't see them being any other typings unless they pull a Jigglypuff and make it ugh, normal fairy. That won't happen. To sum up my feelings on Galarian Ponita, I'd say, I love it, it's so cute. Oh. But hey, you might think differently, so let me know what you think about this uh, beautiful beast in the comments section below. And also, subscribe or Game Freak will delete Galarian Ponita. That's a promise.